The reason that glaucoma is important is because it causes irreversible blindness. And so if you lose vision from glaucoma, we can't get it back. The good news is that if it's diagnosed early, we can prevent that damage from happening and we can prevent vision loss. The way the eye works is light comes in through the cornea and the lens, and those structures focus the light on the retina. And the retina, it's able to convert the light to an electrical impulse. And that electrical impulse is sent to the brain via the optic nerve. So when that electrical impulse gets to the brain, you are seeing the light and seeing that image. Glaucoma is a disease where the optic nerve gets thinned out over time. So when the light is coming into the eye and getting sensed by the retina, if you have glaucoma, then part of that retina and part of the optic nerve aren't working anymore. And so that light can't get to the brain and that part of your vision, that, that part of your visual field isn't getting to your brain and so you're not seeing that. Someone who has the most common type in the United States, which is primary open angle glaucoma, that vision loss can happen over years and that's one of the reasons we call it the silent thief of sight, because it happens so slowly that, that you don't know that you have it. A lot of people, even with moderate glaucoma, might have some vision changes, but they don't notice them. At later stages, the peripheral vision can be quite narrowed in, and the patient just has a, a central island or, or center part of that vision. But often, even people with just that island of vision don't have a dark or tunnel vision sensation because the brain is filling in that vision. It's filling things in based on what they're seeing in that center part. So they're going to miss things to the side. This is especially concerning for people who are driving uh, because they won't necessarily see cars coming or pedestrians to the side. Most of the time, people don't have any symptoms. That's why it's really important to get your eyes checked, to have a comprehensive dilated eye exam. And so at this eye exam, you'll have your vision checked, your eye pressure checked, your pupils, how your eyes move, as well as a really detailed look at the front and the back part of your eye. So there are a couple of different ways to measure eye pressure. Our favorite way is when we put in those numbing drops and we bring a blue light really, 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 really close. And that test measures the pressure in the eye. If we see something that we want to investigate more, then we might need to get some pictures. Those are pretty painless as well. Glaucoma is a disease that doesn't have a cure and causes irreversible blindness, but there are lots of good treatments. All the treatments are aimed at lowering eye pressure, even if your pressure starts out normal. And we have lots of ways to lower eye pressure. We use eye drops, laser, and surgeries. If you're diagnosed with glaucoma, you need to use your medications and come for your follow-ups. It's really a lifelong disease without a cure, but we have a lot of good treatments. Most people who are diagnosed with glaucoma and treated won't go blind.